Okay, cool. 1110. Uh, delete nodes and return forest. Given the root of a binary tree, each node in the tree has a distinct value. After deleting all nodes of a value in to delete, we are left with a forest, a destroying union of trees. Return the roots of the trees and the remaining forest. Uh, forest. You may return the result in any order. Okay. Uh, that's kind of tricky. But basically, what does it mean? Right? I think the first thing I think about is well, like, I mean, there's the you know the service level problem. But what does it actually mean, right? Um, so basically, if a node is in the to delete, then well, the parent should um, stop stop pointing at it. And the other thing we need to do is also the, the child or the yeah the children. The children are or um, are going to be in forests, um, or they're going to be in their own tree uh, because uh, you know by definition of already being a tree, uh, that means that there's only one path from each node to any other node, right? So if you remove a node, that means everything else is going to be destroyed. So that from that we could build a recursive, uh, f uh, um, recursive, uh, recursive formulation of the problem and just let's code that up. I think the first thing I want to do is um, is uh, maybe naming is hard though, but let, let's uh, let's convert the list to a, a set so that we uh, can do f lookups in linear time, and then now let's just have a depth of search. I think I just literally do a tree farm though. Maybe I should have tried a little bit to not do a tree farm, but uh, so given a current node, um, so. Okay, let's just have a return set. Um, a little recursively, but I, I'm just going to do it. Um, here is equal to a set of nodes. Um, we create this as a result. Uh, and then at the end, we want to return uh, a list of. Res let's convert it to an error. The result converted to a list. Uh, okay, so now what, what, what do we say, right? So there are a couple of cases. If well, we've noticed, none just return. We're done here. Uh, otherwise, uh, mm, well, we want to remove um, the, um, the the link to your child if uh, if it's deleted. So let's look that up. So if no dot left is not none and um, and no dot left dot value I'm going to turn off this order complete it's kind of messy uh, if this is in uh, the delete set then no dot left is equal to none uh, but before that we have to kind of do a recursion on it otherwise we're never going to do it uh, well mm, yeah I mean I guess we could just uh, and we needed to do a recursive thing on it anyway so I guess we could I should do this afterwards. Uh, and then now I'm doing a light copy and pasting on the right side. Um, but let's do a post uh, or pre uh, pre traversal, pre order traversal. Uh, what the hell? Uh, and then we could do it this way. And that's it. Uh, well, I think there's one more thing we said, which is that, uh, okay, let's say this current node is, uh, well, first of all, we want to return the roots of the tree. So we saw we definitely um, add with the, this auto complete, so we add the root in general. Um, and then uh, if node that value is in uh, the delete. Then we want to get, and that means this children are in the result set. So okay, so that um, no that left. Maybe this is a little bit duplicatey. Okay, but I think we're roughly done, minus some maybe edge cases. So let's kind of take a quick look. 
Uh, ooh, that's not great. I guess we don't delete. Hmm. Oh, I, we, I forgot to add some notes to the result. Uh, that's one. Oh no, there it is. Hmm. Part. Oh, I mean, I guess this is a little silly because I just never did the recursion. Step one of a recursive function, you have to call it. <laughs> uh, okay, good, good, good. I was a little confused looking at the code debug. Um, so usually I would look at the balance, but here, uh, ooh, wrong answer though. Uh, you, um, here I did not look at the balance because, um, uh, because this is linear. Uh, that was my reason, but uh, I do seem to have a uh, a case to. Hmm. Oh, that's fair. Because here I added, despite the fact that it was also going to be deleted. Um, okay, I guess we just have to. Uh, I guess we can filter it out either way. Um, Hmm. I guess that's why. Otherwise, we would have put it here instead. So I guess that's a reasonable thing to do. Uh, I did miss this case when I was talking about it, though. Yeah, okay, are there any other cases? I mean, we still do the recursion, so I think we're... Well, okay, fine. <laughs> oh, I didn't do... Oh, okay, fine, I did lie a little bit. That was the thing that I was trying to figure out as well, uh, which is the root. Uh, maybe I guess we could just... Okay, fine, let's just do a post for the... I, I guess that would have been the safer thing to do, uh, but... X for X in the result. If X is not uh, not in delete. Silly mistakes. Uh, I think I'm maybe trying to watch on speed a little bit, but I am practicing a little bit for speed. Uh, but I definitely need to kind of recognize these recognize these edge cases. Uh, oh, did I not delete? Oh, well. Okay, cool. Um, I mean, <laughs> obviously a little sad that uh, I think I just need to be better about the edge cases, uh, definitely at least the second time. I mean, the first time if I missed one, I think that one I was just a lapse. Uh, but overall, um, yeah, I mean, I think th this one is actually trickier than I initially gave credit for, to be honest. Uh, there are definitely some things that I kind of handled, waved over a little bit uh, and thinking that would be easy. Uh, I end up taking nine minutes, uh, which is, I guess, a little bit on the fast side for a medium, uh, but uh, with kind of two wrong answers, it's hard to say that. Uh, I think, yeah, definitely the, the edge cases were very reasonable. I don't think, I mean, it is within the uh, when of what I should expect. So, uh, so yeah. Uh, but so overall, this is of n extra time, extra space. Uh, you can really do faster than that if only because, um, well, yeah, the, or when because you have to look at each node once, uh, but the extra space from... Uh, from uh, um, what you would call it. Uh, I mean, 
because uh, you need to convert this to a set anyway, and it's output sensitive, so you're not going to do faster than O of n space, maybe slightly incrementally, uh, maybe with different parameters. But yeah, definitely good practice. Uh, I think sometimes I get a little bit too fast on these tree problems, uh, and that's something that I'm working on, um, mostly because I miss a very obvious tree case, uh, edge case, with uh, with the node being removed. So, yeah. But uh, 